tell me this isn't one of the waviest tracks you've heard. Hey. Yo, what is up guys? It's Super. Back at it again. If you like what you just heard, stay tuned because I'm going to show you how I made this beat. And also, if you haven't seen, I dropped two music videos within the past month. Cranberry Soda, I dropped a couple days ago. That song is lit. If you're a true fan, you know that song. You know that song. Go check it out in the link below. And I also made a music video for Sometimes. It's called, yeah, it's called Sometimes. I feel like shit. Yeah, it's, it's a more depressing song. I wrote that when I was a little, little sad boy. But they're both on Spotify, both on Apple Music. So go check that out. I'll link it in the description down below. And let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so what I'm going to show you right now is each track layout. I'm not going to show you me playing and mess around with the beats because that takes too long. But I'm going to show you each track, how each instrument sounds. So what I started off with was a melody with a piano. A little sad song because I'm going for that trappy, Asian, sad type beat, you know. I'm trying to see Naruto die in this. I'm trying to see Sasuke fucking lose another arm to this song. Something like that, you know. I'm trying to see Gon get his ass beat. Okay, yeah, I'm with that anime shit, anime gang, right here. Okay, so here's what I started with. Little Steinway Grand Piano. Here are the notes. I kept everything in C major. If you don't know what that means, if you don't know music theory, don't worry about it. Super simple. Yeah, basically there's no sharps and no flats. There's no black keys on this piano right here. So very simple melody right here. Very simple. But it sets the tone. Sets it sets it sad. Sets it sad. Alright. Then with that melody, it's kind of boring by itself, so I had to make a counter melody. And I decided to use a harp. Because harps are pretty fucking Asian. Pretty freaking Asian. And you'll hear what it sounds like right here. Ooh, yeah. Now you hear it. Now it's Asian. You hear that. You hear that now. And then I thought the harp wasn't standing out enough. So I increased it an octave. So these are the notes for the harp. Check them out, just take a look, take a look. Yeah, I'm not gonna go too in depth. I just wanna show you how I made this beat. So with the high end stuff, high end harp, I basically just put it up an octave and you'll hear that it stands out more now. Check this out. You hear that? It's higher pitched, sounds more sad, you know? Sounds more real. All right, what do we have next? Then I'll show you the infinity pad right here. So let's go back. It just adds another dynamic, a little background noise to it. Yeah. Yeah, you hear that. Yeah, you hear that? That's what the infinity pad sounds like. Then let's go back. Turn everything back on. Then I added this little voice dream voice, you'll hear it as well. Yeah, you hear that? These two are the same. I just panned this to the right so you only hear it right here on the right side of your earphones. And then for the dream voice you hear on the left side. I made a pan so it's like kind of cool, adds that little aesthetic. Yeah, yeah, okay. Now, let's add back in. So, so this is like pretty Asian. This is pretty Asian right now, okay? This is what's gonna get you right here. Right here, listen to this, check this out. When I added the choir. And what I did was I basically kept the same notes for all of my melodies, or I kept in the same key at least, just different placements of it. So you'll hear that the choir really makes it sound anime. -y. Ooh. 
Ooh, you hear that? They're chanting a death song right now. They're chanting it. Somebody's about to die. Someone's finna die. Tell me you can't see Naruto dying to this. Yo, Kijima, when Naruto dies, play this song. Play this shit. Play this shit. Okay, and I'll skip these two for now. But now, we gotta get to the funnest part. Making the drum set. Making the drum set. So, check this out. With the bass and everything that's still playing right now, here's what it sounds like. Yeah. Now, see, I'm starting to get trappy now. Yeah, you hear that. Let me add some hi-hats. Hey. See, simple drum set can make this sad song trappy. Now it's got some vibes. It's got some kick to it. Yeah, it, I match the kick, match the kick with the 808 bass, so it just punches even harder. I, I love that when songs just boosh boosh. It's got that killer bass. I don't know. I'm I'm a bass junkie. I love it. I love it. Okay, now here's some snares. You can't really hear it too often. But it's there. You can kind of hear it. You can kind of hear it. And then here's just a little added effect. I don't know if you can hear it. But it's, it's there. And I already arranged the song. So you'll see what it sounds like. You'll hear the snare right here. Yeah, yeah, that's clean, that's clean, bruh. Damn, Naruto, you finna die soon? I'm trying to kill you. I'm trying to kill you off. We need a new Hokage, bruh. Ooh, is this not like the most sad, emotional, trappy Asian beat? All right, well, that basically sums it up for this video. Let me know down in the description, not the description, it's fucking stupid, in the comment section, is this the most sad, trappy Asian beat you've ever heard? I don't know, I, I fuck with it. I'm trying to see some anime people die. I'm trying to see Naruto, you finna die soon, okay? Kitajima, kill him off. Play the song, play my shit. Like I said before, if you haven't listened to my songs, description down below, check out my music videos. Kill, I can't even talk right now. Click that subscribe button if you're a real one, join the family. Ni hao. Give it a thumbs up. If you enjoyed this beat, if you enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.